Oh, please. You think Ryan Coogler sounds the same at a cookout in East Oakland as he does in a boardroom at Disney? You know who doesn't code switch? Eeyore. He's always sad. Ooh, that's true. That donkey suffers. What? <laughs> <laughs> Did you just think of that or is that a famous joke? Let's just get through this queue so I can pop for Clonopin and wake up in Ibiza. Oh, we're going to Atlanta to visit my dad's family, so please don't be on drugs. Wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I'm just, I'm a little nervous. I've never been to a college party before. There's gonna be ass and Chardonnay. That's why I'm dialing my switch up all the way to here. Super duper black? Yeah, this part's gonna be like a Jay-Z music video. In the photo booth, let's just pretend it didn't happen. Oh, but it did. We need to face it. Andrew, you're like sugar to me. I like you, but every time I have you, I lose control and I... I hate to say it, but I end up regretting it. But, Missy... My parents are right. Wow, what a gorgeous and spirited exchange of ideas. I love partying. I thought this was gonna be a Jay-Z video, not an episode of Dear White People. No, shh. This is so much better. Please. Monkeys do it every day. Oh, Nathan, your wit is only matched by your fat package. Oh, fat package. I feel better now. Black, Dad, how come everyone knows that except for you? Tell them, girl. Uh -huh. I know I'm black. Then why don't you act like it? Thank oh. you. I act like myself. Stop it, Missy. He's perfect just the way he is. As you. Mm. You. Going for the kill, Missy. You better stop stealing our men. Oh, oh, she oh damn. Too too far. Far. Oh, I liked it. Missy, the who needs a beetle when we've got Atlanta? See if they know Donald Glover so you can suck his knob. Don't say knob. If you need to say it at all, say penis. This is America. Oh. No, 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 no. Read it? Mm. Please don't. But do we look like it? Missy. Oh, you got little titties growing in. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. These girls. This is the fucking crew. All right, show Missy and her little titties her room. She's staying with you guys. <laughs> okay, titties, let's go. I don't want that to be my nickname for the entire trip. Oh, yeah, we gonna call her titties. Darn it. You are so inappropriate. That's my job. And besides, I like Devon being my friend. But he is the coolest boy in school. And did you see his hot little nipples in the Wakanda sequence? Mona, you know I did. But he's a married man. Hmm. Can I eat some weed gummies? I got so high and now he's freaking out and I don't know what to do. Oh, Zary, you guys did marijuana? Don't you know what that'll do to your developing brains? Huh? You're probably never going to be able to remember anything again. Do you even know who I am right now? Um, oh, God, I'm freaking out. Am I getting a contact high? Are we going to jail? You know, I just I just wish I could be myself around my friends more. You can always be yourself around me. Aw, thanks, Missy. Grab him and stick your tongue down his throat. Missed you, Missy. Yeah. I missed you, too. Our parents are being crazy, right? I mean, you want to be with me, and I want to be with you. What if we... What if we dated in secret? Oh, you mean like Fatima and Gustavo? Yes, except, of course, I won't be a horse. You like it? It's very... Different! Just to be clear, different is not a compliment. What do you mean by different? It's just all those braids are so elaborate. I, I don't know how manageable they are. Oh. She did not just say manageable. Monica, ixnay on the manageable man. What do you even know about my hair, Mom? You've been washing it with toothpaste. It's a six in one. Well, it doesn't work on black hair. Straight back. But Shit, her mom taught her. Yeah, she says you're never supposed to say that word. She can't say it because she's of the Caucasian persuasion. But you can. Oh, no, no. I don't, I don't. I definitely cannot. Yes, you can. I promise you it is not okay for me to say that word. Oh, this party will be so fire. Yeah, everybody's going to get burnt up to a crisp and there will be flames coming out of... I don't know. I wish I had one of those code switches. Don't even worry about it. I got you. I'm about to be black enough for both of us. Okay. I'm going... Everybody look at Missy. There's absolutely nothing provocative about her clothing. The way she's dressed, she could be a boy or a girl or a minion from the Despicable Me franchise. What? Andrew's back from the floor. He says good morning. Good morning, Andrew. I seem to be suffering from a classic case of swollen tongue. <sighs> I was wondering if you would like to go to the science museum tonight with me and my parents. Andrew, your girlfriend just asked you out on a date. What do you say? Say yes. Missy? Or should I say, sup? Actually, I think I will actually just say, with, oh, what? Oh. You should be mad at me, Lars. I'm the one who cheated. I thought you were going to lie about the timeline. This isn't how I wanted you to find out. <laughs>
I wanted to let you down gently in the in the young adult section at Barnes and Noble. Quit staring at her. The show's over. You hey, none of them are worth your tears. They don't deserve me. Let's burn them all and rise from the ashes, stark naked with three dragons. Yeah, I think I'm finally ready to watch Game of Thrones this summer. Mm, I'm more into Westworld, but okay. Holy bonkers, this is a real trifecta for me. Hanging out with my parents, science, and my bow. Oh, am I talking too much? Cyrus, you let her have dry papaya, and now she's bouncing off the walls. I didn't give her any papaya. I think she's sweet on someone else. He's talking about Andrew. Haha, <laughs> yes. Shh, Missy, I think that you're a very cool person whom I enjoy spending time with. You think that? I do. And I wanted to ask you if it's not a bother currently, if perhaps you would be my girlfriend. <coughs> Does that mean yes? Yes! I would like that very much. When we're together, my insides throb like my intestines are in my heart. I know, and I'm reduced to a trembling heap of highs and nervous fun. will never bother you because you know there's nothing there right uh yeah i guess i am lucky i got the nine one four on lock his handle my okay chill out with the nick cannon energy devon isn't set to nick cannon he's actually set to super duper black yeah, yeah, yeah. he has this incredible thing called a code switch it's, 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 do you it's, it's, have a code it's, switch lena hell no Bro I don't mind my boobs. What boobs? You're flatter than the earth, Flatso. What? Low flat. <laughs> Actually, the earth is not flat. Tell my pastor that. Missy, I wish I didn't have to wear a bra. What is that, an undershirt? Oh, uh, it's Kirkland's signature. They also make water. That's sweet. Oh, hi, Missy. I Welcome to the team. Thanks. You know, I really can't wait to... Oh, that was a little bit of vomit, and I think it happened because I am truly excited to join you in this odyssey of inquiry and exploration. Stay. It's just that I'm really struggling with my racial identity right now. Uh. My mom's white, my dad's black, I'm voiced by a white actress who's 37 years old. Uh, it's all very overwhelming. Yeah, I hear that. Well, I like braids like Quintus, but practically speaking, I don't think I have enough hair. Oh, don't worry about that, baby girl. We got plenty. Oh, no. I don't want somebody else's hair. What the hell you think I have? So your hair is a liar? Oh, I'm a hater for real this time. And worst of all, they've been depriving you of your own culture. They have? Yes. Have you ever had your hair braided? No. Have you ever been forced to watch a bootleg of a Tyler Perry play? I don't know. Do you prefer sweet potato pie or pumpkin pie? What's the difference? I'm going to slap her in the face. Your parents haven't let you be black. What? I'm trying to get like you. Yo, stay up, fam. Stay up, bro. Devon, I've never heard you talk like that before. How do you talk to black people? The same way I talk to white people. <laughs> what? Are you serious? You don't have one of these? What? You don't have a code switch? No. How does a code switch work? Uh, I, I think this is where we're supposed to kiss. Should we do it? Yeah. Later? Oh, yeah, later. Yeah. Yes. Yes, we should do it later. Yeah. You know what we, we can do? We, we'll do it on the day. That's the performance, or on the day, as they say. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. So it could be French or whatever. We could try but to... But we could also plan on it the on the day. On the mouth. Okay, uh, I should go. Yeah. You know what I'm tired of Ixnaying? The Ace Ray Octane! The what? The race talk! Missy me! Why are they talking about Issa Ray? You guys haven't taught me anything about being black. I didn't even know the difference between pumpkin pie and sweet potato Pie, okay? I like all pie. Missy, come on. Don't you see how offensive this play is? You can't quit. We worked too hard to get you here. I'm sorry, Jesse, but don't worry. I'll affect positive change from within. Or maybe I'll just get caught up in the fame and have a really good time being the star of the show. Oh. Missy, love the new look. Yeah. Fucking fantastic. Well, fellas, this actually is not for you. So avert your male gaze and keep your comments to yourself. And do not touch my hair with your eyes. Okay. It's really like that book. Well, right now, Fatima is trying to track Gustavo's movements by following the stars. So she creates a rudimentary astronomy lab. Oh, my God. H have you read Doubting Andreas? He, too, creates a rudimentary astronomy lab. Have you ever looked up at the stars and thought, wow, the world is so big. And I'm so small? And yet so loud.
Oh, hey, Missy got her hair braided. The new look is tight. Thanks, Devon. My head has been throbbing for weeks, so I actually really needed the positive reinforcement. Oh, wow, so cute. You have black girl hair now. I've never really thought of you as, like, a black black girl. Oh, it's cool how you found a way for a compliment to shake me to my core. Do you want to come to the sleepover, too? No, I'd love to come. What are you doing? I could use another smart girl there. These chicks are scared. I've never been to a sleepover. Actually, there's a nightgown I've been saving for a very special occasion. It was my grandmother's. She died in it. One day I will also pass away. Maybe in this. Who knows? Maybe during a sleepover. Just kidding. <laughs> this is actually...